curiosity. It fails me. Let me find you some help. Perhaps there is a doctor I can take you to. Too late. Yet, there are still many things I must do. My life's work. A treatise upon the heavenly stars. I must get it to the House of Wisdom before my rivals claim it and steal my glory. If you wish, I can deliver the treatise for you. And then, there is my beloved son. Today, he and I argued most bitterly. Without his forgiveness, I cannot. I will fetch him so that you can make your peace. No, the treatise first. Help me retrieve it. Please! I shall do so. My father was an architect. He too had his glory stolen by a rival. Ah, my heart! <laughs> It. I will find the treatise. It has three pages, each separate from the others. Please find them for me. The wind is picking up. Its profundity weighs heavily in my hands. These numbers are beyond my understanding. There you are. That is all of them. I must return to the astronomer. No. no. This is not how it was meant to end. He has passed from this life. Ahsan Allahu Azaakum. The spirit left him before I arrived. Though his body remains warm to my touch. We argued earlier. It was my fault. I came to make amends. But I was too late. And you? Who are you? A momentary friend. I retrieved your father's treatise. And now I offer it to you. He said it was his life's work. His? His life's work? Those were his words, yes. I see. And me? What did he say of me? He 
Kaminsky begged me to seek you out. But I ignored him and chose to secure the treatise for the sake of posterity. Posterity? Lahanakallah! I am his child! And you denied me my final moments with him? Just go. The sight of you makes me sick. Let me grieve my father in peace. <laughs>